morning. How's it going? I'm Mari and this is my PCT vlog. We got up at 5 a.m. today to try and get more miles in before it gets too hot out. And we just got treated to a lovely sunrise, first sunrise of the trail. So that's exciting. I think I can get up earlier more often if I get to see a sunrise. <laughs> My cold is feeling a little bit better. Now we're gonna go walk to water and have breakfast. Let me show you this interesting water source. Ooh. <laughs> Good thing for water filters. <laughs> um, it's a really hot day. Nick set up our tarp so we could have some shade, but it's pretty hot under here still. And we've got some cold soaked ramen, although. It's really warm. <laughs> my, my water is so warm. Yeah, as Nick said, it's pretty warm. <laughs> See you guys. See ya. Now we'll walk a few more miles till we're tired and call it a day. picked our camp spot for the night. It's just back there. I'll show you later. But we're eating dinner now, looking at the view. We have got dun 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 Idaho Spuds mashed potatoes. Not sponsored. We are gonna add some nutritional yeast also, cause why not? And that's about it. We're pretty low on food. But tomorrow we go to town. It's a very exciting day. <laughs> I'm most excited for a shower and to wash my clothes because my clothes are so filthy and I am filthy. We do the baby wipe cleanse every night but like it's not the same. And there's just like caked on layers of dirt like on my hands. It's disgusting. I won't show you. Uh, <laughs> yeah so I'll get up bright and early in the morning and walk about six miles and then to Scissors Crossing and then we will go to Julian. We have been told that there might be a bus going at 8.45 a.m. that only goes on Fridays and tomorrow's Friday so we're gonna try. Anyway, it's beautiful and we're super tired today because it was just so hot. We walked about 15 miles today so I feel pretty good about that. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. And all right, we're gonna eat dinner now and enjoy the view. So I'll show you our little campsite. So we have like a split level. <laughs> it's like luxury here. We've got our ground floor level. Lounge. Yeah. It's, this is yeah the lounge, the living room. Very exciting. And then we're gonna go upstairs to the bedroom. Ooh, the bedroom. Yep. And there's Nick down there. We're trying out tonight just sleeping with the fly off, just the net up. So. See how that works out? Yeah, but that's it. I think now I'm gonna I'm gonna brush my teeth and jump into bed and watch the sunset. Sounds like a good day. Alright, good night guys. Yeah, morning. It's 6 a.m. and we're on our way six miles to try and catch this mystery bus <laughs> into Julian. What's the 
breakfast. Bye bye. Mm. Who can say what we know is true? I've been searching all my life and I finally found it. The world's biggest asparagus. <laughs> oh. Sorry, Mary, you don't have to put that in. If we lose, then we really lose. Or is it lost that can lead you to fight? We made it to Julian. We ended up hitching a ride with a really nice man who had a truck and uh, like five of us got in, so I don't know, the bus never came, at least not before we left, so it turned out all good though. We just had breakfast at the Julian Cafe and Bakery, and right as we were walking in, we met two men, um, and they invited us to sit with them, so we were like, sure, why not? And now, yeah, we went and dropped our bags off at the hotel, and now we're just sitting on this bench. <laughs> Got some fresh Julian apple cider, so good. Watching all the action, there's a lot of hikers here, a lot of people in town also, and it's a really cute town. So we checked into our hotel. I asked them if they had any laundry, if there's any in town, and they said, mm, everyone just washes their stuff in the bathtub. So that's what we did in the bathroom of our hotel room, and we've just hung everything to dry. My shirt is looking so much cleaner though, so I'm excited about that. We are gonna go into town, get some dinner, maybe a beer, but it's been really nice. We've just been relaxing on a bed, like wet luxuries. <laughs> Let's go see what Julian has to offer. Uh, we came to the brewery, I'm drinking a Julian apple cider. Ooh. I know, because I saw her get it. Feels weird to be in town. <laughs> good morning from Julian. We had our free breakfast downstairs, which was really good. A little buffet. Oh, there's Nick. How are you doing? Pretty good. I'm ready to get back out there. <laughs> Then we went to the markets. There's two markets in this town, so we got our resupply. We'll be in Warner Springs in about two days, so we can get more food there, but they don't have as big of a selection. So yeah, we got some good stuff, and now we are kind of just packaging it into our little bags, our food bags, taking it out of uh, the packaging that it comes in, putting it in our Ziploc baggies. It's a whole process, it takes a while. Um, but it feels good. Then I'm gonna give like my food jar a good wash because it's looking real grimy. Here's our little little baggies of overnight oat mixture. Cliff bar, ramen, candy. I got curcumin, turmeric. I had that before. We got some tortillas. Got some Cheez-Its, yummy. Yeah, and then I think we'll wait around till the afternoon and then get back on trail so we can kind of wait out the hottest part of the day. Oh, we gotta get our free pie still. Did I tell you about the free pie yet? One of the big reasons I wanted to come to Julian, I heard there's this place called Mom's that gives out free pie to hikers, PCT hikers. So I heard about that when I was doing research months ago and I was like, yep, that's a place we're going. That's kind of why I wanted to come here else. <laughs> Worth it. So anyway, I have all high hopes for this pie. there to get uh, put our thumbs up basically a woman came around and just asked if we wanted a ride she said she's done three trips already today so she brought us down here now we're back to the trail easy peasy yeah sweet back into it <laughs> 